What's this deal? Okay, fuck it. They can handle them. Damn it. Shield. Okay. I can still get back in. And another shrapnel cannon. Okay, apparently that can hit them. Fuck it. Oh, uh, there's a few more down here. Okay, I got the mortar shells. Now I can do something. Fuck, it takes ages. I'm glad I've got a speed buff. Okay, I've got some of these. May as well make some use out of them. Okay. Oh, fuck. Ow. Black Rock Grenade. I don't know how much damage it does, but it's... But it helps kill them. Rivet Sealed Breastplate. Uh, same item level. Anyway, iron auto cannon. And now we're coming up to the final box. I do, this another terrible design decision. Like why would you have something like that? You think they would have taken precautions, even if it's not an intentional design choice? You think that there will be precautions? Because, well, they could, you know, burn down the whole tent. Even if there is a metal frame, I question, uh, considering the speed it's going at, I question how much the metal, the metal frame would help. Um, like, they certainly wouldn't be able to stay on it, and the cargo would all be lost. And who, certainly who knows where it would end up. Hey folks, and I'm back. Sorry, I was paranoid about stuff. Ugh. Oh, Goblin Scout. It, it just, again, like I was saying previously, it seems weird the Iron Horde will work with the Goblins. Even if the Goblins are, you know, selling their services, considering the propaganda we saw on an earlier mission, you know, only trust your own race and all this, um, it, it just seems strange because they aren't orcs, they're goblins. So it just seems weird that they would work with them. Especially when they seem to hate everyone who isn't an orc. Are you just going to fart electricity on us, or are you going to come down? Okay, it's a ladder. Good. Alright. I don't like this boss. Oh, I got frozen here. Good thing it's right next to you, so I can keep stabbing you. Here's hoping they don't have any abilities to knock me off the train. Oh, Christ. Fuck it. Take a wee bit of damage. Oh, Christ. The moment I get here. Actually, no, I'm fine. 
Good, good. Good, I can actually hit the enemy for more than five seconds. Oh, I, I got stabbed with a, a spear or something. Yeah, I, 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 I'm gonna be honest, I can never be a healer here. It's... All this stuff is way too chaotic, way too fucked up. I'm having difficulty doing it as a DPS. And I'm, you know, I'm, I'm the less stressful of all roles. Did, did you see the size of those bombs? Unless there's a pittance amount of powder in them and other exploding You think something about, you know... The whole thing would have just went wowie. Then again, maybe this wood is really durable and built, the whole thing's built to last. Would certainly explain their willingness to, you know, like fire to their whole things. Ah, here's the in the core of iron. The heart of the Goblin Iron Star technology. It rattles when you shake it, then wheezes just angrily. angrily. It's goblin, huh? I thought it was iron hort, like orcish. Interesting. It's it actually is. Again, like the propaganda, it goes against that propaganda, which begs the question. I think I'm using that phrase rightly. Why would they use tech? You know, goblin technology will only work with the goblins. Or have the goblins work with them on their plans when they hate everyone who isn't an orc? It, it maybe begs the question is incorrect. It certainly raises some. Okay, let's see how full my end is now. Three there. There's the ramble over there. No one down here yet. It's oddly well lit for a place with no light sources. Beyond the firefly. Well, the candle actually. That's one good candle. Okay, I'm gonna have to go deal with that fire now. So I'll be back in just a moment, folks. Hey folks, and I'm back. So, let's continue. Just having a look around. I... Mm. This room is different. Seems it got a bit of redesign. Ah, uh, Mill House is here. And there's Gammon. That's who I have to get the uh, iron limbs thing for. And then there's Hylord Darien Mograin. Mograin. Let's queue up for another one. Making good progress. I have one, two, three, four, five, six uh, dungeon ones done and one of the legendaries. I want to actually do this legendary series, so yeah, I'll be working on these quite a lot if you get me. Oh yeah, I don't have any quest log space, do I? Ah! Yeah, you can drop that. It's the uh, fishing daily from, from the last recording session. The Broken Precipice. For those who don't know... No, it's not in Frostfire. It's here. So let's go get this place done and dealt with. <sighs> that problem again. Here's hoping this take. It says 18 minutes, but it it could go take an hour. It could take five minutes. It's probably going to take 18 though. 
let's hope it doesn't, um, end up dropping me somewhere. Like, I'm just flying along right over Shot Rat, and it just drops me right in the center of it. Even if I survive the fall, I'm probably going to break my face uh, on one of the Infernals. You know, blocking their punches with my face and all. Just having a look at all the different um, things here. Hmm, crystals there. Yeah, that place is just covered in crystals. Unless I was hallucinating. But I don't see any pink elephants, so I don't think so. I guess I should take that uh, take a look over there at some stage. Um, there's apparently an echo of murmur around here somewhere. Where I have no idea, but apparently there's one somewhere. The quest. Maybe it's part of a quest chain. Oh, actually, one second. Become trapped in amber. Yeah, you get it from archaeology. And if you want to get one that works for you, go to the Coaxi. They, they will give you a health regenerative item that is that temporarily traps you in amber. The, probably doesn't have the same effects, though. Black flame daggers. Hmm. Covers your feet in blazing magma. Can't touch this. Uh, since it's not marked for horde only, does that mean I can get it? Like, uh. If you give me a moment, I'll find something that's marked as horde only. Like, see there, this is alliance only. Since that isn't, and it, but it's in Frostfire, doesn't that mean I can use it? I presume so, but who knows? Moonfang on Frostmoon Island. Huh. Uh, see all these things re re relating to Ice Crown Cit uh, Citadel. And a named NPC, like more down here. The, when you kill artists, you get a you can get a box. I think you may need Shadow of uh, Shadowmore. It's the legendary axe that only melee DPS or well any melee character can get. No, no. Let me take a step back. Warriors, death knights, and paladins can get it. Anyone that can wield a two two hander. Oh, High Mall Sorcerer, 100 Elite. Yeah, lovely. Ah, Outriders uh, Bridal Chain. Uh, War Leader Tome drops it. You know, the guy who runs around? Yeah. Alright, I'm going to fight my way in. Ooh. And if I do so, I get 46 gold and 800 Apexis crystals. And I get more fragments, and they can drop the crystals themselves.
yeah, I can't use those items. I just tried, uh, unless I'm in the right dungeon. Disappointing, but that's fine. Very kind of you to give me two fragments. Ugh, fluey. Ah, oh, this guy. Cool. Hey, you with the face. You you mean the guy not with a face? Ugh. It would actually be weird if there was a guy without a face here. It actually starts making me think of fringe. You gotta help me down. My pants are shaping like crazy. Oh, that's why I got to get you down, not back to stuck in hostile territory. You're looking for what now? I mean, yeah, sure, whatever, just get me down, alright? You need payment first. I've been hanging here forever. I was flying around surveying the area for Nixie when Blammo, one of those stupid ogres, threw a rock right at me. My glider bust, and here, I'm, here I, I am. And boy, is this uncomfortable. Will you help me down, will you? Help me down, will you? I'll make it worth your while. Sorry, my quest log's apparently full. No, I turned it in. Fuck it, let's go kill the rare. Okay, here, here's big boy. Spine Crusher. Well, let's hope he doesn't get a chance to do that to mine. Oh, I should've got in the tank. I know that'll reset him, but fuck it. Uh, hello, tank on your six. Damn it, I cut the flame vents off just before um, it was done. I love this tank, like seriously, it's taking on a level 100 rare, and it's just tanking the blows. <laughs> like seriously. Like, it's fucking awesome. It just killed a level 100 rare. By itself. Fuck yeah. And it drops a very good mace. An agility two-handed mace. Huh. Okay. Also drop nine Apexus Crystals, a Primal Spirit, and five Gorian Artifact Fragments. Oh, Gem of Transformation. Okay, that's fine. Might of the Ogron. Boulder Crushing Strength. Oh, this is cool. These obviously are going to be next playable class. I'm joking, by the way. Well, playable class? No, playable race. It's just people are always saying, oh, it's obviously going to be the Naga. Um, but, so, I'm just taking piss, really. They don't actually give the fragments, they just give a send of gold. Ooh. Cool. It's an idol. Uh, honored all the ancient ogre relics within the broken um, tent. Broken precipice. There's my English skills. Uh, you do he can't even tell uh, that there's well no ogre on there <laughs> I personally even though I know that's a scripted event and all that I find it funny personally I think I hear her wagging her tail so it's just really cute she thinks she uh, she thinks I'm talking to her Precious. 